hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we're back with a <laughs> unboxing. Now, this unboxing is different than any other unboxing I've ever done on my channel. Why? You're going to find out here in a few minutes. So I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. This diamond painting comes to us from the folks over at Saner Craft. You remember Saner Craft, right? They're the ones with that cute, adorable little uh, rainbow uh, vacuum. You know, the one that attacked Maggie. So, <laughs> um, so they contacted me and asked me if I would be willing to show one of their kits. Because they also do sell diamond paintings. So I was like, uh, sure, I guess. But this kit is a little bit different. What makes this kit different? Um, first things first, just seeing it, it's a box. It says diamond painting, has some instructions on it, you know, whatever. Um, Saner, it says Saner Direct, but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be Saner Craft. It's a 12 by 16 inch, okay? I don't know if it's round or square, so we're going to look at it together, and I'll tell you what's up with it. Um, so, hold up, is that pork glue? So again, I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. So this is the kit, okay? This kit has 30 colors. It is square. But what's so different about this kit? I've been asked about this numerous times, and I always say no. I say no because I don't like surprises. But when they asked me, I was like, okay, all right, all right, fine. I'll do it. It's a small kit. It's a mystery kit. Do, 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 do. I have no clue what this kit is. Um, hold on, let's see if it's pour glue or double sided adhesive. It looks like a pour glue kit. Nope, it's double sided adhesive. So I don't know what it. Oh my god! All right, does anybody want to take guesses <laughs> on what this kit could be? Because I have no clue. Um, it looks like absolutely nothing. Um. <laughs> All right, so this is a mystery crit, mystery crit, mystery kit from Saner Craft. It's, the box says Saner Direct, but I'm pretty sure it's Saner Craft. Either way, it's Saner somebody. And this is their mystery kit. And again, it's double-sided tape. It does have 30 colors. The canvas fooled me because a lot of the times when you see canvases like this, they are uh, poured glue. So I'm a little bummed that it's not poured glue, but that's all right. Let's look at the symbol clarity, shall we? Oh, if oh, it was wrong with my little tripod thing. So as you can see, symbol's nice and clear. It is a little confetti heavy. Have you ever done, and see, look, it says Center Direct at the bottom here. Center Direct. We're going to say it's Center Direct. If it's Center Craft, you know, whatever. It's, it's a company. I'll link it. They also gave me a coupon for you guys, so we'll talk about that more in a few minutes. But this has a lot of confetti. Which tells me that it's something that has to do with trees or outside. Because usually nature photos, look, listen, they are some of the most confetti riddled kits you will ever own. So we're going to ride the struggle bus and try to get this on here as neatly as possible. Nope, not on there, right? Let's turn it sideways. And then, of course, that will help flatten it out. Nice and flat. There we go. So, the kit is nice and flat. We have doggy snoots. Hello, Daisy. Ew, Daisy. That's gross. All right. So, we have our drill. Daisy, it's not food. We have our drills. Sorry, you might be able to see Daisy over here, like, trying to figure out what this kit is. Daisy, I don't know what this kit is. Do you know? So it does have a, okay, Daisy. It does have a legend, but of course it gives you, it gives you the DMC codes and the quantity, but it doesn't tell you what the kit is. So you have to drill it to figure out what this kit is. In a way, this is kind of cool, but the, one of the reasons why I don't do mystery kits, cause I'm always afraid that it's going to be something stupid. Like, um, I seen somebody do one and it was an ice cream cone and I'm like, why would I spend all that time for an ice cream cone? So, like, I'm really hoping it's something cool, like a really cool tree or something. The colors don't look like a tree color. Like, it's hard to guess what this is. <laughs> this, okay. In one sense, I'm intrigued. In another sense, I'm scared. Because what is it? Just just tell. I, I don't like surprises. Tell me what it is. 
if you are someone who likes mystery kits, this, this is going to be the unboxing for you. I love the fact that they don't put colors on the, the legend because the canvas itself is in black and white. And that actually, if I could see the picture, I'd be happier. But I can't see the picture. So, again, it has 30 colors. And we are going to take a look at them. Color number 20. And again, it is square. Then we have color number 19. What do you guys think it is? 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. The drill quality looks really, really good. 6. There's some dimples in the bottom, but it doesn't really affect anything as long as it doesn't have knobbly bits, which I'm not seeing. We've got some shredded carrots right here. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. So we have a lot of white. And then we have 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, and then 21. So those are the colors. So, so far, the, the symbol clarity is clear. The drills look really good. It has a legend with it. It does come with a toolkit. You get two of those white pens, one with a 10 placer and one with a four placer. You get a decent plate of wax, a white boat with a funnel, and then you also have uh, some baggies. So again, I don't know what the image is, but you will start to see me working on this because this one's going to be next because I've never had a mystery kit and I'm very, very intrigued. So you'll see me working on this in live. So I, I would say if you're into mystery kits or this is your thing, Give them a try. Everything looks good. Everything I need to start it is here. I can't really comment on the picture because <laughs> there's no picture. So I'm very intrigued and scared at the same time. So I'm really hoping this is something cool. So you guys, again, will see me working on this in live. So yeah, I, I give it two thumbs up. It's very mysterious. <laughs> I, li I, I like the way they did it. And it's a 30 by 40 size. And we're going to check to make sure it measures true to size as soon as I find my keychain of doom. So let's see if it measures true to size here. And we're going we're going from the top of the canvas to the bottom of the canvas. We might want to turn it over. So we have 35 here. Then I'm going to guess it's 25 here. 25 here. So it is not true to size, but it is actually a decent price. And again, the people that sent this over are also giving me a discount code, which you will see at the bottom of the screen. Use that discount code to get a discount off this kit. If you would like to try a mystery kit, come and do one with me. Um, this is going to be super fun. I'm, I'm really excited, but I'm kind of nervous. So uh, for those folks that wanted to see Miss Coffee do a mystery kit, here you go. And it's not a huge size, so it won't take me forever in a day. I mean, it still will because of everything else I have going on in life. But it, it shouldn't take me forever in a day to get through this. So, again, if you would like to try working on a mystery kit with Miss Coffee, go ahead over and use the link down in the description box. Do keep in mind that I am an Amazon influencer. So if you do use a link that I link with my influencer, one, it'll say an aff affiliate link. Um, I will make a small commission, so I thank you in advance if you choose to use it. Um, and then, of course, there will be a discount code right above the link that will give you a certain percentage off if you would like to go down that road. But with that said, folks, I got to get out of here. Thank you to the folks over at Saner Craft for sending this over to me. I can't wait to get started. Again, this is going to be my next kit because it is small. So, yeah. So, always do keep in mind that I must... Do keep in mind that... <laughs> And with that said, I now must bid you adieu, but not before reminding you. It's hard out here in these crafty streets, so please remember to wash your hands, don't touch your face, keep your six feet, always wear your mask, and always try to be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys!